Hi. I'm here to talk to you today about identity theft, your personal information, and computers. Out here in the country, we've got simple ways to take care of some of life's pesky problems. One of those is, what do you do when you have an old computer, and you don't need it anymore, but it's got information on the hard drive? Oh, you can erase the hard drive. You can go to the store and buy fancy software that says it cleans your hard drive. But yeah, we keep hearing stories about how some Yahoo grabs that thing out of the trash and is able to pull out credit card numbers, information, photographs, things you really just don't want anyone to see. So what do you do about that? Well, you can call one of these fancy companies and have them come out and do some voodoo on your computer. And you know, you can't see it. How do you know if the information is really there or not? Some little gee whiz geeko tells you it isn't there anymore. What, are you going to trust him? The guy doesn't even have good personal hygiene. How the hell are you going to trust him about? Well, I want to show you a simple way out here in the country that we can deal with this issue, and you can do this at home, too. The nice thing is it doesn't require a lot of supplies or expense on your part. It's pretty simple, and it's very effective. So I need you to come out to my barn with me, and we're going to show you what to do. Don't you hate that message? So what does that mean? Does that mean that I'm safe to throw this computer away now because there's no operating system in it? I don't think so. The basic equipment is pretty simple. Every good old boy has it in his shop somewhere. It's a little oxyacetylene torch is all you need. Let's show you how it works. The basic premise is if we can get the hard drive out of the computer, then we can physically destroy it and we'll know that everything on it is gone. No matter what anyone else tells us, no fancy software is going to do that. There's one good way to do this. It involves a little bit of an operation. A simple tool and a torch. We've all seen will it blend? But my question is will it melt? I guess it's time to find out. Well, clearly it burns. Where is that pesky hard drive? I guess that's one way to destroy the hard drive so nobody gets what's in it. Don't you feel better watching that than having some pimply-faced kid tell you that your information is safe? Don't believe him. Do it the country way and be sure. Not convinced that it's really gone, that your data is really off that computer? There's one follow-up procedure so that you're really certain you'll sleep better at night. Let's see. It's just a little bit bigger than a thumb drive. We'll call it a fat thumb drive. It kind of slides in, just like a USB port. Right at the bottom. And then you just fire it up, and we'll go see what happens. I think it'll take care of your problem. I'm feeling better about the data already. Don't forget, you can do this in your own yard. Just go find somebody who lives in the country, they'll have all the tools you need, and they'll take care of your computer. Have a good and secure day.